What's going on guys, it's Alina in Bonanza Crypt channel and here we go with another ICO project, Axbrick, a new crypto exchange allowing to access liquidity around the globe. We have seen many attempts to create a more transparent, more fair and more professional crypto exchange. Each of them provides one or two features that set them apart from the crowd. The one we will take a look at today, Axbrick, aims to facilitate crypto traders' access to tradable liquidity across the world. Axbrick promises to deliver the next-generation cryptocurrency exchange. Through their platform, they intend to make trading of high-quality blockchain-based assets more secure, reliable and efficient. The technology behind Axbrick continuously scans and gathers tradable liquidity from channels across the world, allowing users to access the global cryptocurrency market. It also enables them to trade at the best buy or sell prices for the desired crypto asset. Developed by Axbrick's strategic partner Liquid Alpha, the dynamic liquidity providing engine DLPA is a core feature of the platform. It is configured to trade against client orders in circumstances of no liquidity and has an algorithm to execute orders under certain conditions every few seconds. The engine will also continuously code five levels of tradable bits and ask to add liquidity and depth in the order book. In addition to traditional trading order types including limit order, stop order and batch order, Axbrick is developing advanced order types. Augmented automation with those order types will save users time while helping them obtain optimal execution. To help new users create and verify accounts, the automated Know Your Client system is connected to global real name databases, which will allow them to use their local identification documents and run real-time identification online. This should reduce the entire verification process to 5 minutes. To help organizations manage tailored needs in a flexible authentication structure, Axbrick is developing a corporate level account system. This will enable organizations to assign specific levels of access and administration authority to its linked Axbrick accounts. The Axbrick project was launched in November 2016. Once the technical team was all set in December, they began with development. In September 2017, they completed a round of venture capital raising, and November saw the launch of the web-based Axbrick exchange platform and the Axbrick Android app. The iOS application was rolled out about a month later. Since then, the Axbrick team has been further developing and improving the platform. They will open their pre-sale around on May 11th, which is expected to be followed by a public sale in the third quarter of the year. Axbrick plans to further develop their product after this. The Axbrick team is headquartered in Sydney, Australia. It is comprised of Lee Zhao, CEO, alongside his position at Axbrick, he directs VS Capital an investment firm and its co-founder. Liffa worked as a financial analyst at Wingate from 2013 until 2016. Bill Richie Young, CEO Like the CEO of Axbrick, Young maintains his position at VS Capital and its co-founding managing partner. He also acts as a director of Stonewall Resources. His LinkedIn profile features experience in finance since 2015. Mark Yi, Chief Risk Officer Mark is a director of Bluestone Mortgages with a professional background in finance starting 2005. Virginia Lam, Head of Marketing Virginia is a serial entrepreneur who has founded several marketing startups and maintains the role of marketing lead at the Abyss. David Coe, Chief Editor David X, a managing editor of Investor Talk and communication and social media consultant with several companies. The advisory board of Axbrick is now separated from the team and includes four experts. Dwayne Gammon, System Development Advisor. His LinkedIn profile features work in the fields of financial analysis, trading and trading software development since 2002. Yun Lin, Cybersecurity Advisor. He is the VP of Engineering APIC at Continuing Technical Advisor of T Alchem Ventures. Brandon Savelook. Legal advisor, Brian is a freelance lawyer and a consultant to Orbit Legal Resourcing. Chloe a digital marketing advisor. She is a lead generation and digital advertising strategist at her own company, Viva Results. The Axbrick website features publication on Reuters, Digital Journal, Bitcoin Exchange Guide, Creators.net and four other regional Asian resources. The Axbrick Twitter account has 2,098 followers. The Telegram group has 7,134 members and the Facebook page is followed by 4,028 users. Axbrick is not the first attempt to create a better crypto exchange. However, neither their website nor white paper explains how they are going to be competitive against similar projects. If you try to follow the table of contents, you will be surprised to find out that at some points it doesn't correspond with the content. 
But it seems to be alright as long as the team claims that the current is a preliminary version of the document. Another interesting discovery we made in a quick review of the white paper is that XBRIC was the first exchange ever to enable trading on BTC. XBRIC is now the first attempt to create a better crypto exchange. This means that the competition they are facing is going to be tough. Therefore, we would like to see a clear revision by the team of how they plan to be competitive. They outline the features of XBRIC, but still some comparative analysis of competitors would make them sound more convincing. One more notable thing is that they didn't specify the soft cap. However, the Axbrick exchange has been live since late in 2017 and has already gained some positive fame from crypto traders. Please note that this review by Bonanza Crip is all opinion and analysis, not investment advice. So thank you guys for joining us today. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and let us know what you think in the comments. It was Bonanza Crip. See you guys.